Hey, hi, hello, it's me, Rad, and we, ooh, don't, don't worry about that, uh, we have a fairly big update for the channel going right now, so, uh, a couple of things that I wanted to talk about. First of all, uh, I've updated the Patreon a lot, um, the Rad Plays Patreon, um, first of all, I guess the, the biggest thing is that I have uh, removed the $10 and up uh, marker for, like, the tier. We're down to one tier. And it's probably something that I should have done for a while now. It's been um, kind of inspired by uh, another YouTuber that I really uh, like and respect, uh, Raukow who also has a Patreon and only has one tier. And honestly, it's like, it feels like it fits the best out of like all the, the attempts that I've made. Um, when I first started this Patreon to begin with, um, it is full of like lots of good intentions. I think, uh, lots of stuff that like would, otherwise be good but like it wasn't stuff that i could effectively keep up with if i did it like that like i was rather so like i i promised vlogs which i couldn't really do on a regular basis like i wanted to uh i promised uh behind the scenes things for the the channel and whatnot like uh what i do to make the whole thing work and it's really not that complicated yet at least so like there wasn't much point in that i mostly did things that i thought were right at the time like i thought were good ideas at the time but upon closer inspection weren't actually things that really needed to be there so i've kind of brought it back down to uh one tier and uh made it the the vote for uh the next game to be played which has changed from a monthly vote to a vote that is now like set to whatever uh timing is is uh around the game the um the thing that i want to do with it is as soon as i start the the new game for um the patreon side of things i want to start up the next vote basically so that no matter how things go i'll i'll know what the next one over is going to be so it's going to be basically, what was the last vote for? It was for that. I'll start playing now. Start the new vote now, basically. Um, the other thing is that it is, I'm I'm uh, bringing the shoutouts to um, the $1 tier as well. Um, and I'm going to be basically loading all of those, all of the names that will be in the Patreon onto a end stream like screen thing and like have it go on a rotation uh for the end of the stream. So uh at the end of every stream I'll have the little rotation of, of names and everybody will be able to see themselves and it'll be a, a fun time. Um so those are the those are the two. Uh you'll get to vote for the next game over and uh you'll have your name on on uh all of the videos from now on if you are a Patreon user for me, Patreon subscriber, whatever you want to call it. Um and I've also changed a lot of the wording on the actual Patreon uh page itself which you're going to want to take a look at as things go uh i've changed a lot of things that control the way that this channel works namely in 
the sense of like the the games that I'm playing, how I'm playing them. Um, obviously, you have uh, seen a lot of new things uh, as far as like how that goes because I'm doing streams now. I do big stream uploads, big like multi-hour long stream uploads and uh, such. And that's how that's probably going to be continuing to go from now on. Um, just because I like doing streams more, I feel like there's more interaction there. There's more uh, stuff going on as far as like having the community together and doing cool things like that. Um, speaking of the community, if you haven't already, uh, gotten your hands on it, we have the Discord channel now, uh, the Rad Zone 4.5 at this point. Um, you should go and check that out. There's a link in the description. For the record, I've also updated the description to be a lot less cluttered and a lot less busy and the links are a lot more prominent. It's all easier to get to. I tried to make them, like, nice and segmented before. Like, you would have all of the ones for a certain thing, and then all the ones for another uh, certain thing and everything, and it, it was a bit too complicated. Like, I, I had some uh like descriptions for what each link was for basically before and i don't need all that it's not really something that's needed so now it's a lot simplified a lot more simplified at least i mean um so that is what is going on over there um but yeah go check the description it's a lot nicer now that'll be good when you go and check that out the next thing, and if you have any more questions about the, the Patreon, then you can send it to either my email at uh, RadicalApolloHQ uh, at gmail.com. Yeah, RadicalApolloHQ at gmail.com. That's where you would put that. Uh, once again, it is RadicalApolloHQ at gmail.com that is where you'll find all of that stuff otherwise uh the uh next thing that you should know about is that i have if you've watched any of the uh latest uh stream archives and stuff like that you'll notice that i have less of a focus on intros and outros than i did before uh, that is mainly because of the fact that when you're dealing with multi-hour long videos, putting, like, intros and outros in feels like it's not exactly terribly worth it, and, uh, my current setup for doing things is extremely lag-inducing, and it might be down to me not having uh, my second RAM card, which I uh, would likely need to make my computer run faster and everything, but I lost that uh, a good while ago, and that's probably where a lot of my problems are coming in. Um, but it's in, in the long scheme of things, it's not terribly useful. Um, you can find my next videos easily enough, uh, one way or another, by just going to my channel. Uh, I'm still gonna be doing the, uh, the, the, the playlist and stuff, so that's gonna be easy enough to find more videos in a certain series, one way or another. You're not going to be missing out on, on anything with that. Um, and honestly, it's becoming less usable lately. The um, end screens and stuff from YouTube. Not just because of how poorly they're set up, really. Um, 
but also because they don't allow Patreon links anymore. A lot of links are actually not working uh, with uh, YouTube at the moment for one reason or another. It's it is unbelievable, honestly, that a lot of the things that used to work just fine don't work anymore for no actual reason. Probably just because Google is a bad company <laughs> at the end of the day. But it's it's there's not much that I can do, so uh gonna have to rely on the links in the description, which are easy enough to look at either way. Um but yeah, less focus on those. It feels like they aren't terribly needed right now, and I'd rather people just like get right into the video instead of having some preamble or postamble, <laughs> I guess. Um but the that's that's basically how it's gonna be the the way that videos have been for a little while now that's that's how it's gonna continue uh hope nobody really minds that i'm hmm. I'd say I'm a little disappointed in uh needing to get rid of intros because I really did like the whole idea of having different people come in and say that's fucking radical in one way or another but jesus sorry everybody i'm having a bit of a rough time at the moment um anyways i i um i like that kind of thing but it i don't think that it really had all that much going for it really but uh, that's probably not terribly important. The main thing that I really wanted to talk about were the, uh, Patreon things and one other subject, which is game suggestions. So I've opened up a, uh, game list, basically, uh, which will also be in the description. And the game list is going to be a list of games that I've both either well, not both, that I've either played on stream already and beaten or are, are kind of, like, currently playing, um, or they're ones I want to stream eventually or want to buy and stream eventually or want to have and stream eventually. It's, um, that kind of stuff. Um, and... The game suggestions are basically you, anybody who wants to, um, can send in a suggestion for a game to play on stream. And it's totally free. It's not a Patreon bonus thing or anything like that. Though um, the Patreon is going to start using those uh, games in the game suggestion as... Uh, basically a a center point for the the votes and everything so uh keep that in mind and it's it's going to be like five choices per vote from now on so we'll we'll see how that goes that being said you know what i kind of wish that um patreon had a a choice where you could have like you could give everybody up to five votes and um, just, like, put in the games as it stands per month and then, like, have them put in as many votes for whatever that they want per uh, that kind of thing. I feel like that would help out a whole lot. Uh, anyways, it doesn't matter. It, it does matter, but it doesn't matter right now. The point is... Uh, you can go to, uh, once again, the email of RadicalApolloHQ at gmail.com or to my ask box in uh, my uh, channel Tumblr at RadPlays... Actually, what what is the actual URL for that? Right, no, it, it, start, it would start with uh, Tumblr for that. So let me... 
get that together. Let me get that together real fast. It would be, it would be, yeah, radplays.tumblr.com. Because uh, Tumblr links are dumb. But yes, if you go there and then go to the ask section, which you can put in as anonymous uh, if you don't already have an account one way or another. But if you don't want to, then you can just use the email. And you can submit as many games as you would like to see played on the channel as you want. Uh, not all of them will be up for uh, like contention for the the spot or anything. They'll be considered. Everything will be considered. Um, but it kind of depends on my own uh, taste of things, on if I think that it's going to be good to stream one way or another, whether it will be legal to stream. <laughs> I guess in some cases, we're not going to play fucking anything along the lines of like a, a, a porn game on, on stream. That's not something that's going to happen. But in other cases, if it's just kind of like an RPG that you really like, I will consider it because I'm not terribly hot on playing RPGs on stream, but if it's an action RPG, I'd be more likely to play it because those are uh, more my style either way. But it the game suggestion thing will help expand things and let me know what the people that watch my channel would want to see more often out of my channel or would just like to see in general out of the channel, out of things that you think I would be good at playing or you would like to see me play one way or another. That is the goal of everything. As you guys know, or hopefully will know one way or another in the future, I, it means a lot to me to have a community, to make a community that is inclusive, that is nice to each other, that is good and does good things for many people. Um, and that's the kind of thing that I want to make out of this channel, out of all of the things that I do. And I'm on my way to doing that. One thing that I'm going to be doing in the future, which I should put in, in a video form, which I, it's, if there's ever a good time to do it, it's probably right now. I'm going to be doing a uh, charity stream in the future, probably in December. Uh, it's going to be a 24-hour uh, stream where I just go at it. I just do a, a, a whole 24-hour stream of either several games or uh, one game that is fairly long and I just go at it for a full 24 hours or I go at several games for 24 hours um, and like maybe potentially beat several games in that amount of time we'll have to see because 24 hours is a long time and i can probably beat a couple of games in that amount of time if i mainline them but i don't know if that's uh what would happen but yeah i i'm planning on doing a charity stream i haven't totally decided what uh one I'm going to be doing it for, but probably Child's Play or um, what's that other one? I can't remember off the top of my head, but there's um, there's like a, a, a ton of different ones that I could be doing it for. But yeah, I'm going to be doing it for uh, one of the ones that you can automatically get stuff sorted out to that kind of thing. But that's in the future. That's in December, most likely. Um, speaking of months, I'm probably not going to be doing um, monthly 
updates or anything like that. I more likely than not, I would do channel updates and, and such when applicable, like when I feel like there's something that needs to be said or done, something that needs to be explained one way or the other. Uh, I say one way or the other a whole lot. Don't worry about that. That's that's just how my vocabulary rolls. But yeah, in in the future. You'll see more updates because I want to do more things along the lines of of making shit happen on a regular basis, but probably nothing along the lines of a uh, monthly update where you just get all the th things that I've been doing in that specific month or anything. Uh... That's that's not really how I'd like to roll with things. That's not really how things should be rolling, I guess. But yeah, that is pretty much everything that you need to know. Uh, oh, and if you haven't already checked, I have a uh, schedule now, which is also going to be in the, the description. Um, the schedule is for my... Uh, like uh, streaming schedule and everything and you can always see what i'm going to be streaming next i have uh the stream updated every week not like it's basically a week in advance you'll uh find out usually i put up the the next week's schedule for uh friday basically friday or saturday i'll put up the next one so You'll find out what I'm going to be streaming pretty much right away as far as that goes. So check that out as well. But that is that is everything. That is everything that you need to know. That is everything that I need to tell you. You have been taught about my ways once again. Thank you all for listening to this. Thank you all for checking this out because it means a whole lot. Uh... Also, I don't know, you can check out the new channel, like, uh, intro thing, the intro thing that I just put up, uh, which will probably be going up before this. You can check that out, it's not very long, it's basically just a, a rundown of things that we do on this channel now, but it's, it's, I wanted to replace the old one for a while now, because it was on my old mic and it sounds like shit, so... Yeah, I've replaced it now. So, hey, cool, cool stuff. Cool stuff all around. I will see you all later. I love you all very much, and I hope that you have a good day. I hope that you have a good night. I hope that you have a good whenever you're listening to or watching this. Goodbye. Bye now, bye.